know, if we're lucky, we get to stick long around long enough for people to say stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> One of my music business teachers in college said, um, "Making a living as a performer is a war of attrition. If you live long enough, you will become a legend." <laughs> Can I set my watch by then? <laughs> a couple more decades or so? Oh, yeah, David Honeyboy Edwards. He was part of that whole generation with Robert Johnson and Sun House. And he outlived them all. He lived to be like 100. He was still gigging at age 99. You know? That's me. And I, he never had so much work in his life. You know? It was just like, well, he knew Robert Johnson. You know, let's book him. <laughs> Wow. Ramblin' Jack Elliott used to play with Woody Guthrie, and that's, he's like the last living guy that was, you know, wow. good friends with Woody Guthrie. Yeah. Um, yeah, Dave Van Rock used to say that a career in folk music meant typically the refusal to do anything else. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get an amen? <laughs> that's right. I think that's been my career path right there. <laughs> Soundly leaving logic at the door and proceeding anyways. <laughs> we want to leave you with this song that is, uh, you might say it's a song about heroes, but to me, 